know this district very well. And the reason for that is because I was born in Arapahoe County. I was born in Inglewood, went through Inglewood Public Schools, went, met my husband in Inglewood Public Schools, and now we are raising our family in Arapahoe County. It does, it is a big part of who I am because I was uh, raised here. So I'm familiar with the communities that make up Arapahoe County and I feel that I've had the opportunity to be involved in a lot of different parts of our community. I grew up in a wonderful family that supported me. We were always encouraged to know about what was happening in our community, to know about what was happening in the newspaper and to learn about our community around us. The way that I've chosen to give back to my community is to get involved in, in our schools. I started off doing a lot of the things that a lot of parents do and helping out with the room, room parties for Valentine's Day or Halloween or that type of thing. But quickly I started realizing that that the school community was very open to having parents involved at a higher level and a greater level. One of the places that I feel that I've learned the most about our school district and learned the most about a lot of the budgetary issues that are facing not only our schools, but our cities, our counties, our state, is through the Financial Advisory Committee. I've been on that committee about four years now, and we are to take a look at our budget and make sure that we're being fiscally responsible and we advise the school board in helping them make some of those decisions around budgetary constraints. I really honestly believe that the best way to learn about an organization is to understand their budget. If you understand their budget, you understand their programs, you understand their values, really. So that experience in working with the Financial Advisory Committee is experience that I hope to take to the county level as a county commissioner. In the school district, we, as I have said, had lots of budgetary issues that have faced us. So how do we come together as a community to continue to make our schools great even though we're having these, these uh, financial difficulties? The school board in Littleton decided that it was important enough to go to the voters and find out how they felt about the budgetary constraints. And I gladly took up the chair position to run the campaign for a mill levy to support our schools. We had hundreds of parents come together, community members come together for a grassroots movement to provide additional sources of funding for our school district and the mill levy passed. It really helped me understand how important a grassroots movement can be. And that's why this is important at a county commissioner's level is to understand that people can come together. People can come together and make solutions. They can come together and forget their differences to work for the greater good.